Howdy partners and a warm welcome wherever you may be. I am Cowboy Jeff bringing you another episode of my road to the show and we are back at the Great American Small Park ladies and gentlemen to take on the Cincinnati Reds. The Dodgers, my Dodgers are on like, I don't, I think we're on like on a 20 games or a, a winning streak or something like that. Maybe more like 15 or 13 games but it feels like 20 games as DJ LeMahieu getting warmed up right there. You know it'd be very nice if the Dodgers actually had DJ LeMahieu who the Yankees, you guys better pay that man. Pay the man, because that man is an absolute stud. He's a baller, just like this man right here, Cowboy Jeff. Look at those stats. Oh, my goodness. Those are PH fat. PH fat, baby boy, as we got our new bat skin. Uh, we're using the beach uh, bat skin today. You know, kind of, I'm, I'm away from Los Angeles. I'm away from home, so uh, I'm in Cincinnati, Ohio right now. So I wanted something that would remind me of home, and boom, shakalaka. We started off with a double, not in the gap, but you know, no, 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 no. We're not going to get one of those hustle doubles like Kevin Kiermaier we're gonna stay at one and uh, the Reds and Bumgarner is on the mound as we have a 138 game hit streak how you like them apples bum the mad bum who's a lefty he might actually throw me out if I'm not careful be on the lookout Jeff be ready be ready and he's a d -d 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 whoa that was close Woo! Like Ric Flair would say, that was very, very close. 3-1 to count, top of the first inning. Runner at one, that would be me. The Dodgers, literally as of this recording, are down. 6-3. to three. Jeff, go! Jeff, you gotta get there, you gotta get the... Oh, it's gonna be a double play. Yeah, double play. I should've just tried to... I should've stolen two right there. Then there wouldn't have been a play at two. Uh, the Dodgers are losing to the Rays. As of this recording, 6-3. to three. And Joey Wendell. Joey. Joey has three RBI right now. He has as many RBI as a Do as the Dodgers do. Blake Snell was pitching lights out until he gave up a home run. Uh, I, I forgot who it was. It wasn't to Will Smith. It was to uh, who was it? It was to somebody. I forgot who. Uh, but his his no hitter was broken up as that uh, right to the warning track to center field. Right now we are up one game to zero in the World Series as we got Puig at you. Yasio Puig. Haven't seen Puig in a while. So this is a this is a very interesting game. We're going up against Mad Bum. We got Puigachu out there on at the plate. Uh, but yes, Joey Wendell is uh it's kind of bittersweet, guys. It's very bittersweet for me because you know I love you know how much I love uh Joey Wendell. I think he's the GOAT. He's one of my best players, one of the oldest tenured players on my Diamond Dynasty squad, Joey Wendell. Um and he's I'm I'm happy for him, but I'm not happy that my Dodgers are losing. I hope the, the best case scenario is, is if uh, what, what, bum, bum, mad bum, what do you want right now? What do you want? You're, you're trying to challenge me right now? Alright, well, right, I'll get to you right now. Anyways, as I was saying, uh, <laughs> uh, Joey Wendell, if he has like 10 home runs and like 50 RBI, but the Dodgers still win, that'd be the best case scenario. That would be best case scenario. Nah, 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 nah. You're not going to give me on that curveball. No way, Jose. It's 0 0 the score here on the top of the sixth inning here at the Great American Small Park. You know what? Let's go slow mo. Slow. Another. No, that's a cut fastball right there. Mad Bum, you can never take uh, him lightly. We all know what he can do. One of the most clutch pitchers in, in postseason history. That's gone. See you later. Sayonara, as Team Taco would say. See you later. That ball is not coming back. And in case you guys haven't seen, in case you guys haven't seen my last uh, Wii Sports video, go check that one out. It's uh, It was Game 6 of the Wii Baseball Classic. I'm not going to spoil it. Like I said, go check it out. It's a very entertaining game. We've we've gotten in, we've gotten in some pretty big holes against Sakura. Sakura has been, she's been like Blake Snell the past couple games. But uh, our bats are up to the task, that's for sure. Here in the top of the eighth inning, 1-0 the score. And whoa, look at that graphic. That must have cost a lot. Look at MLB Network with their nice little graphics right there. Cowboy Jeff, I noticed, kind of crowds the plate a little bit right there. Uh, no doubt, Jimmy Jack. And uh, oh, I thought I was going to hit the guy that was selling paletas or something. I don't know what that... Uh, do they even sell paletas in in, uh, in the Great American Ballpark? As there's a slider right there. Okay, top of the eighth inning, 1-0 the score. Um, guys, in case you guys haven't noticed, by the way, or, or haven't seen... Bobby Crosby has come out with some new softball videos, some new content. We haven't been playing because of the, you know, the C word, because of quarantine. But we are back, ladies and gentlemen. We are back. And uh, I got to say, I am very, very rusty in terms of hitting, in terms of the outfield. I'm not feeling like myself. But uh, uh, yesterday, I actually worked out for the first time in months. Uh, I, I, I decided to finally get some... Uh, Go to the gym. Well, not to the gym, but I went to the park and and shot some shots. You know, I did some sit ups, some some bench press. You know, I, I lifted a couple weights, and right now I'm pretty sore. I am pretty dang sore right now. And no, no bad pitcher. 
No, trying to get me off guard. I don't think so, homie. Top of the eighth inning, runner at one. So, yes, I'm very sore, but I will be back in shape. I will be back in shape, and the ideal scenario would be to get back in shape in time for football. Come on, Jeff. Come on, baby. Oh, we almost got thrown out right there. Woo, that was close. Okay, nice jump by Cowboy Jeff. Uh, just how I want it. And I was, uh, I feel like I'm a little slow uh, as I am in real life. You know what? Let me tell you something, guys. I haven't played basketball in so long that when I was actually shooting just regular shots and I was getting my, my shoot around in, I was sore the next day. I was sore just from shooting shots. That has never happened to me in, uh, in all my life. In my almost 30 years of life, in, in case you guys don't know, in uh, October the 23rd, I'm going to get thrown out. No, no. October the 23rd is my birthday. But yes, my birthday is coming. Oh, no, you jerk. He got, oh, safe. Oh, that was close. I cannot believe it. I got saved by the hair on my chinny chin chin. No way. No way. We're going to steal. And now he got me. And he's just going to try to tag me out right there. You jerk. Okay. Ah, oh, okay. It's all good. It's all good. All gravy. We still won the game. Walker Bueller, who's going to be pitching tomorrow for game three, is still the, the he's still the winner. We take the win. Uh, AJ Pollock in the back. Corey Seager was having himself an incredible playoffs. Uh, the yeah, this World Series, you know, it's still early. He's not doing so great right now, but it's still a long way to go. Um, it will, hopefully, he could get back on the on on the horse. Cowboy Jeff, three or four, a home run, and an RBI. Kenley Jansen with the save. Let's go on to the next game. Alrighty, game number two against the Cincinnati Reds. We gave Madison Bumgarner that L, and he's probably crying. He went to sleep that night crying uh, into his pillow because, you know, Cowboy Jeff uh, pimped that, that home run, that no-doubt home run off of Mad Bum. And we all know Madison Bumgarner, he don't like when you do that. Uh, but it's all good, man. You'll, you'll be fine, Madison. You'll be fine. Luis Castillo now on the mound versus my, my dude, my boy, Julio Urias, who's going to be pitching game number four after uh, Walker Bueller pitches game number three tomorrow. Top of the first inning. We got runners at first and second. Here we go. Here we go. Let's see if we could uh, do, do, do four seam fastball. Okay, I was expecting a curveball right there. Um, but no, no curveball. No, he doesn't even have a curveball. I thought for some reason I thought Luis Castillo had a curveball. He's gonna go uh, slider. Slider. No, he went another four seamer up and hi high and up, I should say. 98 miles per hour. Come on, Jeff. Make something happen right here. Let's not worry about no home runs. Let's let's, let's just get some contact. Some nice solid contact. Um, we're going to save our slow-mo pitch. There's going to be a single right between short and third. That might be a run score. No, base is loaded for DJ LeMahieu. Hopefully, he makes something happen, man. No, Okay, we did. 3-0 to a bottom of the first inning. Nice, nice. Uh, Cowboy Jeff has been trying to do his very best to uh, make a name for himself out in center field and, and maybe win a gold glove. But I noticed that I'm not really uh, – I'm not in contention because I don't get many uh, – I guess what the, the 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 statistic is an, an assist. I don't get many assists. Um, I'm not really good at throwing people out or you know saving runs and all that stuff. Um, my guy's not very he, he's not very fast and he doesn't have a very good arm. Uh, so we'll we'll be working on that for sure. Later on in my career, Cowboy Jeff with nerves of steel, just absolutely staring at that 96 mile per hour fastball right at my eyes. Okay, here we go. Runners at second and third. Come on, Jeff. Come on, come on. There's going to be a slider right here for sure. No, no, he gave me a slider, but it was high. Totally read that one wrong. Uh, the, the the clouds are kind of making it. Uh, it was not hard to see for me right now. You know, with my four eyes, I could see everything. But I'm sure in real life, it, it might be a little bit difficult to see the ball change up 84 miles per hour, two on the count. You got to give me something unless you walk me. I'm not like Randy uh, Rosarena. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not as hot as he is right now. That man, uh, earlier... In the game, the, the the Dodgers did walk him, intentionally walked him. That's how hot that man is. And right now, as of this recording, as of right now, right now, right now, I checked the score. We are only down by two runs. It's 6-4 to four in the eighth inning. And there's going to be 3-2. Three, 3-2 two. Three, two the count. Full count right now. Two outs. Uh, Yo, boy. Whoa, you got to cut your hair, man. I thought I had to cut my hair. Luis Castillo has to cut his hair for sure. Um... It, be ready. Be ready. There's maybe. I had pretty good timing on that. The center fielder's going to catch that, though. Oh, a little bit underneath that slider, man. I knew it was going to give me a strike. I didn't think it was going to walk me, but I wasn't able to get a hold of that one. Top of the fifth inning. Now, the sun is shining a little bit more now here at the Great American Small Park. Let's uh, let's be ready for a slider. Slider, four-seamer, no, 98 miles per hour away. We got runners at, oh, look at that, 2020 World Series MVP. I have a runner at one. I, I Yes, I was the MVP in case you guys haven't uh, been keeping up. I was the MVP of the la of last year's World Series. Hopefully, the uh, Dodger will be, a, will not only uh, 
hopefully a Dodger can take home that crown uh, this year as Cowboy Jeff flies out. Uh, just a weak little fly out. Top of the seventh inning. We are up 4-0 to zero, though. We are in command of this game for sure. This might be my last at-bat of the game. So let's just use our slow-mo. And that might be a home run to center field. No, the center fielder's got that one. Man, come on. You can't hit it any better than that. I'm trying. Okay, I guess I got I to gotta pull it. In the Dodger film games, I've been able to pull it a little bit. And if there was fences normally where we played, I would have had a, a, a pull shot home run in one of those games. But I, I got to muscle up, man. I got to. I got. I'm right now. I'm pretty weak. I'm pretty weak right now. I gotta get. I gotta hit the weight and uh and get back in shape if I'm if I'm gonna hit some home runs, especially on the field that we're playing at right now. That field is huge. It's humongous, dunga. Uh, it's kind of it has weird dimensions. It's it's like diagonal defense. So I believe right field is uh is pretty short. No. Uh, yeah, right field is pretty short. Left field is where you got to hit some mammoth home runs. And center field is pretty short. So I could maybe hit a home run to center field. Maybe if I if I absolutely get full contact and I eat my Wheaties that day, there's going to be a sinker inside. One, two, the count. Bases loaded. I could get a grand salami, but I haven't really hit the ball that well. So let's just be, let's just try to get some hits, man. Let's try to get an RBI or two out of this. Uh, nope, nope, 2-2 two, two the count. He's trying to get me to chase on that sinker. No way, Ralphie boy. You better give me something in the middle of the zone uh, because I'm not going to chase. I'm not going to chase. That'd be funny if I chase right now. There's the sinker. That was a pretty good pitch to swing at. We were underneath that one. Come on, Jeff. Come on, be ready. Be ready. 4-2 the score. We could knock him out for sure. We're, I mean, we're, we're already doing pretty good. Bloop, bloop. Infield fly. No, infield fly roll. Yeah. Ah, he got me on that sinker. You got to be kidding me. But we did win the game. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, oh, oh. 8-2. to two. Bottom of the ninth inning. 1-2. The uh, runners out first and second, I should say. This game is O-V-E-R. This game is in the refrigerator. The door is closed. The lights are out. The eggs are cool. And the butt is getting hard. And the jello is jiggling. Final out of the game as we get the dub. Lakers, I mean Lakers, Dodgers looking pretty good. Speaking of the Lakers, I, I, I just said a Chick Hearn saying right there, congratulations once again to my Lakers who are the NBA champs of the world, their 17th world championship. The Dodgers are looking to, to do what they did. Hopefully, hopefully we can get it done. Cowboy Jeff one for five, my batting average for sure. Maybe underneath 500 now after that game. Julio Urias getting the win, 10 strikeouts. Yeah, buddy, and we are, our winning streak is still intact. So there you have it, guys. If you liked the video, comment down below, subscribe, tell your friends about these. And I'm going to see you on the next one.